Services may go down from time to time due to a number of factors. If you can't play your favorite game like Warzone because Battle.net won't go online, continue watching this video. We'll show you the common reasons why this issue happens as well as the solutions that you can try to fix it. If Battle.net app was previously working on your computer, but it's no longer loading up now, you should make sure that you visit the Activision Twitter page to get answers. This is the most reliable way to know if there's an ongoing gaming server problem. The next good step that you can do, assuming that there's no server problems at all, is to check your own internet connection. First, try using a different device like a smartphone to see if your internet is fine. Do a speed test to check if your connection is fast enough to open websites or let you play online games. Second, you want to get help from your internet service provider. There may be an issue on their end that affects certain websites or services that may not be obvious on your end. Using a different region can help. While the Battle.net launcher is trying to log in, click on the region indicator to change it. Some gamers have reported that deleting the Battle.net folder fixes their problem. This can work if the main reason is due to an outdated or corrupted Battle.net folders or files. To do this solution, follow these steps. Pull up Task Manager by pressing three keys. Control Shift Escape at the same time. Click the Processes tab. Select All Agent, Blizzard Battle.net Desktop App and Game Processes then click End Process. Once you've closed all the Blizzard processes, press Windows key and R key to open the Run dialog. Type C colon slash program data backslash into the open field and press Enter. Delete the Battle.net folder, run Battle.net and update the game to see if the issue persists. If Battle Net app still won't go online after doing the steps, restart your PC and delete the Battle.net folder again. This should prevent another program from interfering with the new Battle.net folder that you installed later on. I personally encountered this issue myself, and the effective fix that I discovered is to open the game in my case Call of Duty Warzone directly without opening the Battle.net app. To do this, press the start button and find the game. Then click the game to open it. Doing so will force the game to update the Battle.net app and hopefully allow you to go online. Do this solution after you've deleted the Battle.net folder. If none of the solutions help, you have no other choice but to delete the Battle.net application and reinstall it. To do that, go to Control Panel, Programs, Programs and Features, Battle.net and click on Uninstall. Then redownload Battle.net application and install it. That's it. We hope this video is helpful to you. Please subscribe to know our latest videos in the future.